A student-led demonstration at this Jacksonville school is shut down by administrators. It was at Lehigh, which is now in the middle of a heated debate over whether to rename the nearly century-old school. News for Jacks reporter Joe McLean has been covering this story extensively. He's joining us now live from Lee. Joe, this development follows your report yesterday about a teacher's Black Lives Matter flag. It does, Tom. We told you yesterday when administrators told that teacher she has to take down this Black Lives Matter flag that was hanging outside her classroom or the school would do it. And that's what happened. Late last night, administrators took down the flag. That's why students tell us they wanted to stage a demonstration today, but they didn't get the chance. After Lee High School teacher Amy Donafrio was told to take down this Black Lives Matter flag from outside her classroom, students planned to stage a walkout demonstration Wednesday morning, similar to the ones we saw last month. Black Lives Matter! Donna Frio said the same banner seen in this footage she captured on February 12th is the same one Principal Timothy Fagans demanded she remove from her hallway door. She told News for Jax in an interview yesterday. Every single thing that we do should be focused on what's best for the kids. Every single, that's my philosophy as an educator, is that we are about supporting the kids and being a very crucial part of supporting an equitable community. Donna Frio said administrators removed the sign late last night, and today students noticed. Um, they took down a poster that said Black Lives Matter that represented most of the students that go here and what we believe in, and they took it down and didn't say why. They took it down. District policy bans teachers from using their position to influence students to support an issue. And a December memo specifically addressed flags, banners, or signage on district property. Today's demonstration at Lee High School was not allowed by the school. Security stood outside like every blockway during the time that we were supposed to walk out. They stood and blocked everything. District spokesperson Tracy Pierce said students aren't allowed to organize an assembly without the involvement of the school's administration. You can't have an unplanned, impromptu demonstration. Now, where is that flag now? I'm told it was confiscated by the administration and it's being held for whenever Ms. Donofrio wants to pick it up. The district also said it's not gonna be commenting on the situation with that teacher. They say it's an ongoing HR matter. Reporting live, I'm Joe McLean, Channel 4, the local station.